rock, rocking that nip wallpaper. For you guys, another video. I'm gonna show you guys how to get 75 prints on your monitor. Um, yeah, all you have to do is have a NVIDIA graphics card because that's the only way I know how to do it is on NVIDIA. So, yeah, if you have AMD, Google it, you probably find it. But NVIDIA is the way to go, boys. Peace out. I mean, not peace out, but see you the next like little part. I'm gonna cut the clip right here. All right, so basically, what you do is you right click on your, mo you right -click on your monitor or desktop, click on NVIDIA control panel. I already have it open. So, yeah, uh, customize. You go to change resolution, customize. I'm going to delete these real quick so I can remake them again. Uh, what the heck? Okay, that made my screen go black, so it's making my screen go black again. So just give me a second. All right, I'm back. All right, I don't know if that's going to make the video go black, but whatever. Uh, 1280. I can do 1280 by 960, which is kind of below resolution. That's what most pros play on, like, get right. Now, when I hit test, it won't work. Take a look. Oh, 75 hertz. It'll like make my screen blurry. I don't know if that'll show up on sh on the screen too for you guys, but yeah. Oh my God, what the heck? Uh, I think I broke my monitor. Oh, it like makes like weird lines and stuff, you know? Guess that's not a good thing. Uh, and it would do that, and that that's if it doesn't work, it'll do that. Now, if you change this to GTF is what I did, I had to find a solution because it wasn't working. Now, you change your timing to GTF, and you hit test again, and it should work perfect. And as you can see, it works. It just makes everything smaller because you're making a lower resolution so you can overclock your monitor to uh, 1080p. I mean, so you overclock your monitor to 75 hertz. So, yeah, uh, that's basically all you do. You get in-game. Oh, there's another program I need to show you. There's a program called Hotkey Res Resolution Changer. And basically what it does is you set two hotkeys. Mine will be mine are control out one and control out two. If I hit control out one, it changes back to 1080p, 60 hertz. That's for like browsing, like right now what I'm doing, making a video at 1080p. When I go in game, control out two, and that changes it to uh oh 1280 by 960 at 75 hertz. So you have to go right here, click on 75 hertz, change the resolution you want. And yeah, that's basically how it works. You just set a hot key, hit change, control alt 2, click the key you want, set. And that's about it. Hope you guys enjoyed this little video showing you guys how to get 75 hertz. Sorry about the cutouts. I was just showing you live. I don't know if you guys can see that like the screen go crazy and it not work because it's just messed up. And I can't I can't uh overclock with automatic timing. Um I can also get uh, 600 by 900, so you might be able to get 1080p at 75 hertz, or you might not be able to. Depends on your monitor. Some people can get 100 hertz. Uh, so there's a couple Chinese monitors out there, or Korean whatever monitors that can get 120 hertz. There's a website about it. Look up uh, monitors that can overclock to 120 hertz or something like that, and you'll probably find some. Thanks for watching the video. Peace out. Yeah.